Hey folks, Silver City Stacker here. Coming at you with a quick unboxing. Really quick. I'm gonna cut right to the chase here because you've already seen it. You all know what it is. I've already opened one for you on the camera. But I got this one in today. Took the kid trick-or-treating. He got a bucket full of candy. And I got a box full of silver. Or maybe not full, but you get the gist. It's something I've already unboxed for you guys. However, this version is a little bit different. As we can see here, it came in this. Last, uh, last one I got just came wrapped up in some bubble wrap. That's interesting. Tape here. Open her up. Nice little box. Okay, so we got the bubble wrap stuff in here. Well, that's cool. Just a nice little box. Nothing special, but pretty sturdy box. I don't want to cut any paperwork that might be in there. Especially if I want it. It's kind of nice if these guys would send me a business card. If I had something legitimate to put up on the, the wall for you guys to look at. Speaking of wall, my first sticker. Need some more of those. Need to get a little flat line and have them design one for me. This dude does some amazing work. I'll tell you what, Pirates intro, dude, that's crazy. All right, got paperwork here. Let's see if I can fold it so it looks right. There we go. <clears throat> so we got horrible focus and bad lighting. Mm -hmm. Let's see, here we go. 3784 unit price. Shipping. Ten dollars. Yes, I came in under the ninety-nine and suffered the penalty. Out the door, forty-seven seventy-nine. This is the collector tin version. And it comes in this somewhat flimsy little slip box with a nice Seven Wonders golden logo. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. That's cool. So we can see several different wonders on there. Honestly, I don't even know the list off the top of my head, so I'm not going to try naming them. Make myself sound like a fool. Metal tin. Little foam thing. And again, cloths, roads. Same size, same silver, 
This is just the gift box version. This is the one that I ordered when I thought I had missed out on the other ones. I wanted to order two of this one. This is the one that did not come in the gift box. And so now we have two drachma, two Colossus Rhodes. They only minted 7,777 of these in the silver and 77 in gold. Incredibly low mintage. I managed to snag myself up two of them. So, I was doing a little reading up on this, and uh, apparently most of the depictions show the Colossus straddling the port entry, as seen here. But, and I take this with a grain of salt, scientists say that evidence supports that the Colossus stood on one side or the other, not straddling. But, it is what it is. These coins have some really nice satin finish on the grass, water, and, and building area down below. I don't know if I can get a good... capsule doesn't do it any justice, let's just put it that way, or the light. In the right lighting you get a nice satin sheen and a little bit of a curved reflection off of the bottom detailing there, not so much off the statue himself. And then also in the right lighting you do the the spin and you get the cartwheeling off of the spirals. Other than that, it's got a really nice mirrored finish. Nice satin finish on the uh, the king there. Mirrored finish on the back with the radial lines coming off the torch. That's uh Quite the mirrored finish. You can see my phone there. Oh look, is that a nose? <laughs> That's a heck of a nose. Maybe you should get that into your videos, nosematics. That's one heck of a schnoz. <laughs> I dig that gimmick, by the way, Nosematics. <clears throat> if you're watching this, that's one heck of a gimmick, and I love your outro. Really hard to read this with this angle and lighting. I apologize. One of these days, I'll be a, a good YouTuber. Until then, you'll just have to bear with me in my laggy OBS and my cell phone videos. And somewhat mediocre audio. But, that, uh, that pretty much wraps that up. Just wanted to unbox that for you guys real quick. Got two of these guys now. A nice little gift box to keep it in. The box itself sells for five dollars on AppMex, or you can purchase the coin with the gift box for five more dollars. And that's what I ended up doing the first time when I thought I missed out on the basic coin. Round. I guess it's a round, it doesn't have a denomination. Not a, not a modernly accepted denomination anyways. Not like this. The 
two dollar new a twenty nineteen quick reveal full review to come later roaring lion waiting on the other half of the set in the mail should be coming any time I'll do a full review on both of them. That sounds like a good idea. I'll unbox it and review both of them. Oh no. My symmetry's off. Oh yeah. That's that. Looks like we're coming up on 11 minutes. I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Just remember everybody, embrace the dip. Buy responsibly and keep on stacking. Catch you guys on the flip side.